Uh, we've had a long pre-season. I think we started the last week of October, which is you know pretty pretty early in a normal the normal circumstances. So we've had a long, uh, pretty tough pre-season. To be fair, uh, it's gone well. We, we had Danny Craven's testimonial game yesterday against Batley, which uh, we ended up winning. But uh, you know we 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 shown the signs that uh, we wanted to show and. All the years that we've been working uh, to improve on, we've shown that yesterday, which is, uh, which is good for us coming up in the season. Yeah, you know, last year obviously a um, bit of a difficult year, everyone was struggling, you know, we got to, uh, with the Covid situation, but then, you know, no disrespect to who we signed last year, but you know, they were um, at the end of their careers. This year we've gone for a um, different tactic and we've signed young, hungry lads uh, who have played in the Championship uh, for quite, quite many years now, so we took a different approach and um, yeah, look, we've got our goals, you know, I think everyone wants to make the playoffs, that's, that's the obvious one, so uh, that's a must for us this year. Yeah, it is, you know, you, you go across the squads and it's like, oh, I didn't realise he signed there and, you know, speaking speaking the change rooms, uh, went to do these interviews and uh, other players are mentioning uh, players they've got from their teams and it's like, oh, you know, I didn't realise he signed there, so every squad's improving, uh, you know, and with what's going to happen in the future with all the rumours about the structural change, you know, we, teams need to start, uh, you know, start improving and start putting themselves in the best position for when that does occur.